Welcome back, Parkview. I'm Mrs. Campbell, and I'm your media specialist here at Parkview High School. I'm here today to show you how to get a book checked out during digital learning. It's my great hope that you all are eagerly awaiting this information so that you can get started on your great next read. So here are the instructions. First of all, you need to be logged into eClass. So when you log into eClass, you will see these options and notice there's all kinds of good stuff here, but you are going to click on the media catalog and hopefully many of you will come back to this again and again throughout the year. Once you click on that media catalog, it will take you to Destiny Discover, which is our uh, place for our Media Center collection. So when you get there, you'll see that you have a search bar at the top so that you can search for a specific author or book title, um, or you can scroll down and see, first of all, we have recently added books that have been added to our collection, so you can check on any of those that might be interesting to you. Um, if you keep scrolling, you'll see that we have topics, and I'll come back to that, but if you scroll a little bit farther, you'll see that we have eBooks, which you're able to check out. Um, our collection of eBooks uh, has, we have a decent collection, but the public library is actually your best bet for the eBooks selection, um, and your um, there are directions on the library eClass page to explain to you how to check out eBooks. Um, but for now, I'd like to revisit the topics and share with you that these have been set up in place so that you can sort of browse some interesting selection ideas based on your reading interest. Um, oh, by the way, up here in this right-hand corner, if you don't see this little icon, you might it might say log in. You'll need to click there before you can go any further um, so that and it will automatically log you in. All right, so back to topics. Let's say that you just love historical fiction. okay? So you can click on this little icon right here and it will take you to a list of all kinds of interesting, book selections um, if you love historical fiction. Um, so I think for the purpose of this, I'm going to show you how to hold a book that looks interesting. First of all, we can look at The Boy in the Striped Pajamas, and that one has some star ratings here, and apparently it looks like it's a wonderful book, which it is. So we can click on that and see a little blip about the book. Bored and lonely after his family moves to Ber from Berlin to a place called Outwith in 1942, Bruno, the son of a Nazi officer, befriends a boy in striped pajamas who lives behind a wire fence. Sounds interesting? You betcha. So if you want to try to, if you would like to check that book out, you simply click hold that button right there. And what that's going to do um, is, there we go. The Boy in the Striped Pajamas, a fable, is a, it gives you a little message at the bottom, and now you've simply, you've been added to my hold list. Um, the holds will all be, all these books that are put on hold will be pulled and checked out in the order in which received, and as soon as we've done that, either myself or Miss Bunsen are going to pull those books off the shelf, put them on a cart, and have them ready for you to pick up. You can come into the school and pick up those books any day once you've received your note that says the book is ready. You will get an email that says the book is ready. Or you can pick it up in a drive-by situation, a drive-through situation on Fridays. Um, after, again, after you've received your email. And on Fridays, the drive-through times will be from eight to nine on Friday morning in front of the school and from 2 to 3 p.m. in front of the school. Those are the times for drive up only. Um, but again, once you've received a notice that your book is ready for pickup, you can come to the school any day from 2 to 3 and come into the media center and pick it up, or you can wait for Friday and pick it up in front of the school. I hope this has been helpful. Um, and I hope to see so many of you checking out some incredible books. Um, also, you can email me, 
Mrs. Campbell, any time um, to let me know what your interests are and I can help you select a book and pick out some books um, that you might really, really enjoy. So have a wonderful rest of your day and I look forward to hearing all about your reading experiences.